three times a week, she gives healing ceremonies in Kawangware, a slum in Nairobi, with prayers, songs, and preaching. Here, on June the 11th, 1988, an extraordinary event took place, which many newspapers and the TV station CNN reported. The people believed that Jesus Christ had personally appeared before them. A journalist from the magazine Kenya Times was an eyewitness. His report starts a week before the event. On Saturday, June the 4th, 1988, a big bright star was sighted above the skies by worshippers. While we were filming, the unusually bright star could also be seen during the day. During the healing session on June the 11th, 1988, the mysterious event took place, which was observed by hundreds of people. Many were left totally healed. Only a few photos exist. The tall figure of a barefooted, white-robed and bearded man appeared from nowhere and stood in the middle of the crowd. Watu wote walianguka chini, wakajawa wengine na furaha, wengine wakajawa na kilio kwa maana wameona kila wajaona tangu wazaliwe. When he appeared, people had no idea what was happening. Many of them fell down. Others began to cry and repent their sins and continued to do so even after Jesus had disappeared and we had begun singing new healing songs again. Since that day, hordes of people have been coming to Kawangware, repenting their sins and being healed and saved. But it is not me who heals, it is the power of God that heals through me. It appeared to them the Son of Man had at last fulfilled his promise of coming back to earth. The unknown person who didn't tell his name turned first to Mary Akatsa. He said, you are an important messenger of God. Keep on preaching, never retreat. Whoever places obstacles in your path will himself be halted. Then the man spoke in Swahili without an accent to the crowd. We are nearing the time for the reign of heaven. But before that, I shall come back and bring a bucket full of blessing for all of you. Before he disappeared as suddenly as he had come, he paced off a path in the direction of the church. Jesus said, I have put my garment here at the end of this path, and whoever comes to this place, perhaps with sickness or demons or other problems, should run along this path. When he returns at the end and runs back to Mary, all his problems will vanish, and he will be free. 